Hey guys, welcome to Supercars of London. I'm in another supercar, Citroen C2, and we're heading up to Kit Customs to have a look at my Audi R8 wrap. So this video blog is going to be uh, an update on how my wrap is doing. You might even get a slight teaser on uh, what color it's going to be as well. So we're cruising up now, we're about half a mile away from Hatfield Tunnel. I'm not going to film us going through Hatfield Tunnel because it will be a massive anti-climax compared to the Army Tricks Audi R8. And we're probably gonna stop off at McDonald's before we head to Kit Customs and you guys get a sneak preview of my wrap hoping that my camera um, is working properly. It's having a bit of a hiccup at the moment. Sometimes it goes black and white, sometimes it's on color. We're on color at the moment, so fingers crossed it stays on color so you guys get to see the color. But if it goes black and white, then unfortunately you won't get to see the color. Maybe I'll video blog in McDonald's. That might be a bit weird. drive is okay, but in McDonald's is a bit weird. And I also purchased a um, mechanism for my video camera to sit on the dashboard for the trip up to Edinburgh. I bought one of those sticky mats, whatever they are, but someone commented, thank you. And um, hopefully that will arrive in time for Saturday's trip up to Edinburgh. Thank you for all of the support, um, all of the comments, and we're just about to go into the Hatfield Tunnel now. Whoa. No exhaust sound whatsoever, um, so I can talk through. I don't know what I'm going to say now. Uh, thank you for everyone on, and your support on the YouTube video of London to Edinburgh introduction. That video is going to be very exciting. Some interesting comments, some people proving that it can be done. But remember, if there's any tunnels on the way like this one, then my fuel economy is going to diminish very quickly. Um, as you saw on the way to Kit Customs a couple of days ago, uh, when I came across a tunnel, there was no other option than to just floor it. So um, we will catch up when we get to McDonald's and then again at Kick Customs. So see you in a bit. Tunnel time in the Citroen. Insane. Absolutely insane. We're now about in the back. I think that's the um, crackle and pop from the exhaust that you can hear behind me. There's the rattle. Completely full after McDonald's. McDonald's told me that I wasn't allowed to film in there because they recognised me from the McDonald's roulette. I'm only joking. Um, I just didn't want you to watch me scoff my food down. But we're about two minutes away from Kit Customs now, so um, I'm starting to get excited. Not sure whether I'm nervous or not to see the uh, colour in the flesh. So, um, yeah, just hope the uh, video camera holds out and doesn't go black and white. What's up, guys? We're down at Kick Customs. Uh, we've got the Audi R8 somewhere behind me, behind this wall. So, um, should we go and have a look at it? Yeah, let's go and have a look at it. Seems like my video camera isn't working properly and uh, seems to have gone black and white. There we go, back to colour. Yep, back on colour. So, um, yep, Kit Customs have shut up now for the afternoon. It's time to get back in the car and come and see it tomorrow. Um, on the way back in the car, I'll be giving you an update on how the wrap is doing and also giving you an estimated time of the video tomorrow afternoon or evening 
or even Saturday. It depends how late the car finishes. Um, that we want to get the car looking perfect, spotless, and looking absolutely epic for Gumball 3000. So um, back to the car, back home, and uh, back to Kit Customs tomorrow. Day one up at Kit Customs complete. We've just left, uh, locked up with all of the shutters down so no one can have a peek. Unfortunately, I think my video camera didn't pick up the color, which is very unfortunate for you guys. And it also means that the big launch can still happen tomorrow. So um, that's all good. Um, I've been told that Kit Customs say that the car will be ready around 7 p.m. or 8 p.m. tomorrow night, which means that even if I began to edit the video and got it uploaded with my internet, it probably won't be online until about midnight, which isn't ideal. So I'm considering uploading it on Saturday morning for you guys to wake up to as I'm driving up to Edinburgh. So um, let me know your thoughts. Would you like a midnight video or would you like a uh, Saturday midday launch of the vehicle wrap? And um, hope I don't get spotted too much on the way up to Edinburgh or even at the way back from Kick Customs. Maybe I'll put like a plastic bag over it so no one can see it. I know you guys are excited just as much as I am to see the final color or whether it's colors or whether it's colorers, whatever it is. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the video and um, I look forward to seeing you tomorrow, whether it's at midnight or whether it's on Saturday, whatever it is, trust me, this is a video you do not want to miss. The unveiling of my wrap, my unique wrap, um, it's going to be uh, ridiculous. So um, cheers guys, thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe. I'm beginning to sweat now, the uh, sun has come out. So I will sign off from another video blog and see you guys tomorrow. Thank you very much. Make sure you subscribe for a hell of a lot more videos.